Welcome back to One Piece, The Clone Wars. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus. But yes, we're back in Whole Cake Island today, and Germa 66's entire army is clones. It was kind of dropped in the last one that Judge had a connection with Vegapunk and that they were on the cusp of virtually creating life. It's absolute insanity. I can't wait to get into it today. If you're new to the channel, make sure you drop a sub and let's get started. Wait, Nobby's going on the aggro. She has to defend the captain. <laughs> exactly. Oh, wouldn't they just bank on her losing the cracker and then losing the Viver card? She knows she can't beat Cracker. Luffy lost to Cracker. And here, well, that didn't lose, but wasn't able to take him down. She's just trying to buy time. Mm hmm. Yep. Yup. Uh huh. This ain't no Don Quixote family. They're a little bit top heavy with Dovel Mingo. These, they, they got some punchers. They got some hitters. Yep. What did I say? Trying to buy time. Oh my gosh. Nami v Cracker and, and Co. Dang. Shadow King Bomb though. Is it King Bomb? Brom? Why do I keep blanking on his name? Thunder Breed? I guess because it breeds more lightning. Wait, wouldn't Nami counter biscuits? Just get them wet. Get all soggy. Dude, there's... He was sitting on a dead street trunk. I just realized that. Poor guy. Dude, there's no way it hasn't been 10 minutes. Oh, no. Oh, how are you on the ground? Nami, get up! Because he's insanely fast! Yes. That's how much he means to them. Yes. Ooh. Oh, you'll never understand how deep their bond is. Oh, what the fuck? Dog! <laughs> She's being straight up. She sees like the low side of him and the high side. Mm hmm. Yep. I like that. I like it is explicitly showing him fighting Delphomingo out despite being outmatched. There's a lot I can learn from you. I kind of want to know more about Cracker and like how he became a general. I, mean, I guess nepotism. He's Big Mom's child. Dude, the, he has the killer instinct in his eyes. It's red. He's running! But she's baiting him in. God, that looks sick. Damn, Nami! Oh. Wait, he's just messing with her. No, you did not drop it! She didn't drop it on purpose, right? Or on accident? Oh, it's gonna cut away, so I won't get invested anyways. He's back! I knew it had been 10 minutes! Let's go! Oh my, that was, that was clean. That was fluid animation. He's back, baby. Did he just hop out of Bomb's mouth? All right, now he knows what to do. All right, rematch. Round two, round three. I kind of want like a full on fight with him and some of his brothers. Wait, he's going after him again. Not just one kick. Holding a hostage. He just has to remind him about Zeph. That's all it takes. Damn. Stealth. Dude, they have such a weak point. A mental weak point. Dude, they don't even have to hurt him. Oh my gosh! What is the electricity? Is that like a devil fruit? I don't... It seems like it. No, Sanji does like Diablo Jame without one. Man, this is just like when they were kids. <laughs> Who's really in charge here? Well, yeah, dude, it's easy to be brave when you're outnumbered or when you outnumber him three to one. Not the same kid anymore, Sanji. You're stronger, bro. Greatest scientific achievements. Wait, what? Wait, is that why Sanji's able to kick with like fire? Oh my gosh. And that's why his brother kicked with like electricity. They're, wait, they have scientific advancements. 
Oh my gosh. Wait, then what are the other siblings' powers? It's not a devil for power, it's it's science. We're about to see. Oh, bro, little Sanji. They always just saw him as a failure. He was never seen as a kid. He was seen as a scientific achievement. So is Judge actually like big brain like that in the science department? I guess he worked with Vegapunk, so he has to be. It's so far down. Bro. Was too scared man i feel more and more bad for him it's like they're really slow dripping the backstory but it's like it's at moments where it sort of makes sense like i almost like this where we cut back and forth between past and present he was just not made for this life oh seeing exactly why judge never saw him as a son see but you see reiju always kind of stood like, like looked behind at him like was never as fast to turn her back on him as everybody else maybe she takes like some level of pity on him Chiji is like the and then rage are like the two most talented but i think they're like the oldest they had to save him it's no wonder the germa soldiers look so emotionless that it makes sense now Aww. Oh my gosh! Nah, bro. No, nah, he's freaking right the turtle. My God. Bro, what even raised you was like, nah. Oh my gosh. These kids are demons. This is so sad. Uh, how is that even possible? So the mom was never there. Oh yeah, look! She she wasn't laughing at first, but almost like she steps in the line. It was all statistics. It was all scores. They weren't just regular kids. Bro! Bro just beating him down! See, but Reiju isn't. So how did he get separated in the first place? The bloodline elements for all four of them. Turn back. Oh. Wait, so he, is he not the same as them? He's just a regular kid. Oh. Huh. So he's not advanced technically. He's just a regular human. Yes, so I'm asking. She has some form of empathy for him. So maybe there is no mom because we're, I mean, no, because yeah, she does it to nah, it's not something line. No, because so, they said Sanji's a regular human. So he Nolan the liar, the devil first. He's reading about Nolan. Oh, no, the mouse is going to die. They're going to take this mouse and cut his head off and put it on Sanji's bed. Oh, no. <laughs> Sanji, she make food for a rat again. Oh, finally! His mother is dead! Okay, I was waiting for them to say anything! He said stop trying to change the legacy. Maybe his mother was a cook? Dang, and it explicitly did not show her face. Hmm, interesting. He's just... The rat! Oh my god, first the turtle, now the rat! Oh. It's teasing it though. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. What should we do? Yeah. What happened? For they like faked his death? But did he just send him off? And that's how he ended up on the ship? Oh, wait. We've seen him with this helmet. I don't know. I don't care. Wait, what did Rage you think? Oh, she, did she know he was alive? She knew. Oh my. They just put him in a cell? What's the point of the helmet? Wanted to pretend that he was never born. Dude. Bro. 
Oh my god, bro. This shit is hella depressing. Oh my goodness. I mean, I know that he was mistreated from the, the jump from when we got here, but this is insane. At least to some extent, he had Reiju and like it explicitly showed that he was like, why are you nice to me? And she's like, I, I only can't all the time because they'll, they'll bully me like relentlessly too. She steps in the line to protect herself. And I I mean, I can't completely blame her. Those, those boys are mean. But it is very interesting. Finally, we get to hear about his mother, but he said, stop following the legacy of the deceased. And I think, like I said, it is in relation to his cooking. So maybe that's sort of where he started to find that passion from is his mother. 804. Imagine you and your whole squad just getting beat up by some kids with la like laboratory advancements. It just would not feel that. I guess they don't really feel much because they were also made in the lab. Everything here was made in the lab. They all just want that gratification, that recognition, recognition from their father. He acts like a dad whenever they perform. That's crazy. That's nuts. This is the most we've seen him act like a dad ever. Oh my gosh. This is so fucking sad. The mouse. Oh, you're going to walk by like you don't remember? Six months in here? They just brought him food every day? Well, whether or not he was alive, the, the siblings didn't even care. I mean, at least they take him luxurious food. At least that's what they just called it. Bro, six months just alone. Wait, how is he supposed to eat with that on? Oh. They open it so that he can eat. Oh my gosh. This is so fucking sad, bro. And he still gives some to the mouse. Or maybe... He said royalty mustn't serve everyone. Maybe his mother was like just a very kind serving person. Like she she wasn't, she didn't act high and mighty like royalty. <laughs> he wanted to be, he wanted to be a cook so bad. His first creation. All the bandages on his hands from cutting him off. This is so sad. <laughs> See my mother. Oh, so she was still alive at this point. Wait, we'll meet her. We'll finally see her. <laughs> Would he take her food that he like made? So their father just put his mom in the medical ward and I'm guessing just abandoned her. What? Whose dog is this? He was taking it to his mom. <laughs> no! Oh my god, bro. He, he clapped that dog. Oh, that's a long neck. Oh my gosh. Here's the medical ward. It all. Oh. I mean, someone have stomach. Yeah, that would definitely give her stomach problems. <laughs> Oh, no, bro. Oh, is that her? I wonder how, what she was sick with. Oh, there she is. Oh, my gosh. Finally, man. Oh, she's so excited to see him. <laughs> Did they make something? Yeah, they made something all nice. <laughs> and, like, she knows that he did it, but he wanted to. Bro, the bandages. Ah, she wanted to see what he actually made. Good mom, good mom. Oh. <laughs> I want to die so bad. <laughs> oh, she's so nice. <laughs> I was like, and before this is what killed her. <laughs> that was a good die, bro. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Damn it, I haven't cried at this show in so long. Oh. No way he actually brought him to him. Oh, he did. 
Wait, W prison guard. He learned to jail. He had a whole little oven and everything. He was able to actually do it down here. They caught on to it. Ugh. Oh no, oh no. The music just instantly. Just the vibes were just shot. Oh my gosh. I could see why it, where they would get to that conclusion though. They could make their dad happy. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I, f I have a feeling Reiju's going to be like the one that steps in. Because like nobody else is going to. Brother. Yep, there she is. It's going to be too, mu too much. Oh. Yeah. She bandaged him up. Yeah. She's still partially human? That's the difference between me and them. She has emotions. Oh, shoot. And he would just be on the ship. Oh, wait, how did they get up the red line? No way did the snails just crawl. Wait, but it would be vertical. Then it would fall off. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Brother! Wait, Shorma is such an insane army. They can go anywhere. Land or sea. That is insane. He must try to... Bro, she just kept coming to help him. He must like prison break or something. You can only take so much. Bro, every time they crawled up, he just got his whole room thrown around? That is... Dude. Name a more intimidating army. Oh my gosh. What are these maps? Is this parts of the world? Koja. Target country. Koja. Koja wasn't the first filler arc, was it? Like at the end of East Blue? Does Koja sound familiar? Bro, all his stuff. He declared his dream. Yeah, bro, what are you supposed to do against them? Superhuman army? Like... Oh, she's... Oh. Oh, he's just saying, yeah, yeah, he wants to be free. Do something with himself. So now I'm like understanding how scarring it was for him to even have to consider coming back to protect the straw hats. This was his hell. <gasps> she broke him out. Oh. Dude, at least he had rage you, man. If, and if nothing else. They just started obliterating this town. And he escaped under the guise of the war. A secret door in judge's room. I have like a feeling the brothers catch him though. But didn't they think he was dead? Whenever they got, whenever he got there, they said something like, I thought you were dead or... Oh. <gasps> I wonder if he let him run away. Just so he didn't even have to worry about him anymore. Or have to feed him or anything. He couldn't care less if he died. He's like, good luck, go try. Mm -hmm. Dude, those 70 days with Zeph on that rock were probably the most peaceful days he's had in a while. Not like easy, but... Mm. He's like, oh yeah, that, that makes my job a lot easier. Which is even sadder that he's like, oh yeah, get out of here. Dude, that's, that's almost worse, actually, than him just running away. That his dad would rather him run away. One last favor. Damn! He's saying you are not a Vince Smoke. And he never did. Never. He was proud to not represent them. Oh my gosh. Bro, how did his mom end up with Judge? She's such a sweet woman. And he dropped a weapon. Just like he never uses weapons, he dropped it. Even Rage you. Oh, bro. That is insane, man. That is absolutely insane. A cruise ship at the port. I'm guessing he got on that? That was the ship he was on! 
The Zeph ship. Oh my gosh. It's all. It's drawn it all out. We know now. Damn, she didn't want him to leave. Oh, she knew he would probably die. Dude, now I see Reiju very differently. How much how much she cared about him then? She has to care the same amount, if not more, now, and is probably very happy that he's okay and very grateful for the straw hats. W sister. She was the only one there for him. Oh my god, bro. Oda just keeps cooking. Oda just cooks and cooks and cooks. When will there be nothing left to cook? One Piece continues to be the greatest anime of all time. Like a brother, this was set up so long ago with a throwaway line about where Sanji was even from. Oh my gosh. Oh, bro, I'm lightheaded. Oh, like I said, I haven't, I feel like I haven't cried in a while. I mean, I got teary eyed in, in uh, Dress Rosa with like uh, Kiro's backstory and everything, like not wanting to hold his child. I think that was the last time. But man, that was, that was brutal. Like how genuine his mom was and how kind she was and how motherly she was. She knew that that wasn't what he cooked and wanted to see what he cooked because she knew that he would have been proud of it and wanted him to be proud of it because it was his creation yeah i don't i don't think judge was referring to her being a chef or cook or anything but her kind heart and he didn't want that legacy to continue he wanted just brain dead soldiers that don't have, feel sorry or have emotions they're just there to take over and destroy everything and rule over everything but now i'm wondering how much impact this backstory has on where we are now because i have a very strong feeling that however all of this goes down reiju is gonna end up on sanji's side over over judging all of theirs and maybe it even ends up with her having to leave the family or like pick a side because when it comes down to it, it there's gonna be a moment where people do choose sides and the family is very strong and i think this backstory has given us very good reason to know that reiju may be on our side maybe on sanji's side and have enough empathy still but it's interesting that they're scientifically advanced too because that's something we didn't really have an understanding of before this but that sanji was like it like reversed i, I don't know if it was like his will or just his his body rejected it because he was different than the rest of them but like thank goodness it did because now he's the sanji we know and love today he could have been in like he could have been this brain dead perfect soldier that his father wanted and this story would be very very different but now it all makes sense how he got away how he got on that ship and how he met zeph it's insane but guys that's been it for my reaction to one piece today i hope you did enjoy drop a like if you haven't already i'll catch you next time peace peace